here's a here's a look at the uh, an ocean kayak tetra nice kayak very fast fast kayak the tetra angler made by ocean kayak I fished numerous tournaments with this guy is Brian very good at what he does Liking your kayak, Bry? I love it. A woo woo! It works perfectly. Light, 50 pounds. You can lift it up on your truck pretty easy. So here's Brian, the owner of the Tetra Angler. So you're quite impressed with it, eh? I've loved it. Not as big as a lot of guys running out there, but it, uh, it's easy to move around. It only weighs 50 pounds, about 10 foot six. Still lots of storage room. You can get a full a cooler in the back there. Have the uh, Scotty uh, spaces in the uh, center console there, so that's nice. You can put lots of stuff in there. And uh, you have the fish finder. What do you do? You have the transducer mounted on the side. I just have the suction cup transducer to the side. Yeah. Right on. And it came with those flush mount rod holders there? Absolutely, yep. Fast too, eh? Like It moves well, it's low profile, so it doesn't actually get pushed too badly by the wind. And uh, yeah, it moves nicely through the water, good speed. Which is nice, you've had it, you were saying, about three years? About three years, yep. Oh, well, she's a nice kayak. Can we see the hatch there, if you don't mind? Sure. Uh, or the fish rod holder off there. That's Scotty or? Yep. Oh, so you took the, you took the sleeve out or did not have no, it one? Doesn't, doesn't come Didn't out. have one? Right. There's lots of room then. I could paddles, rods, I put them all inside. It goes all the way through. Yeah, it yeah. All the way through to the back. So. so you break the paddle down, put it in, put the rod holders inside. I'll put the rods inside sometimes too if I have a full truck and uh, yeah, and you can just, I actually had eight rods in here at one time. <laughs> so it's nice. I like the fact it's 50 pounds. Yeah. 50 pounds is very durable, strong. Handles in the rivers, good too, yeah? Yes. Yep. You, well, we did the Grand together, didn't we? Yeah, I've, I've run in the Grand a bunch of times and uh, no problem. I've been out in some larger waves in Lake Ontario and Lake St. Clair and never had any real problems with that either. So it, uh, can, it's pretty so versatile. You can pretty much use it for anything. Nice, nice. So one other thing that's nice is how you can car top it so easy. Absolutely. Convenience, you can put it in any lake, anywhere you go. You can lift it up by yourself. Lake, rivers, pond. No restrictions.